What's up guys, welcome back to World of Tanks. If full disclosure, this is the second time I've made this video because the first time I said some things that would probably get me banned from YouTube. <laughs> I went on a rant on the first tank. Um, it definitely said some things that would get me in some serious trouble. <laughs> But anyways, uh, let's talk about game rigging cheaters and how they go about doing it. And here we got a prime example of it. I just logged in and I get this message from this person here telling me that they've got a boosting service that they can charge me money to play the game for me. That's essentially what this says. You can read it for yourself. They want to charge you money so they can play the game for you. How pathetically useless and stupid do you have to be to pay somebody else to play a game for you? How sad do you have to be to do that? Like, do you have any any skill whatsoever? Uh, you, clearly you don't. You have zero skill if you're paying somebody else to play a game for you. You, why? Why are you playing the game? If you're gonna, if you're gonna spend hundreds of dollars to have somebody play a game for you, what is mind-boggling? Like why? Why? And the worst part is, I can't even report this to War Gaming. I can't report this message. So check it out. I go, I click here. Service record, friends list, send message, copy to clipboard, create platoon. I can't create an onslaught platoon or add to my blacklist. That's all I can do. I can't even alert Wargaming to this scammer or this piece of crap company that is, I mean, think about this guys. Just think about this for a moment. In order for this to work, or in order for this to work, sorry, you have to one, give this company your credit card information. So they have your credit card information, all of it. <laughs> they have it all. Um, your name, your address, the credit card number, they have the security code number, they, they have the expiration date, they have everything they need to charge your card f with whatever they want to charge it. Anything that they want to charge in your card, they can charge it. You are trusting them to only charge for the services that they claim that they provide. Not only that, but you have to give them your war gaming account information which means they now have access to your entire account they can go through they can delete your account and you would pay for them to do it <laughs> and think about that think about what kind of power you're giving to these people to boost your your gameplay you're giving them complete total unrestricted access to do whatever they want to your game. They can they can sell all your vehicles and you and you would have you, you wouldn't even know it because you gave them your account information. They can change your password and there's nothing you can do because you gave them all of your account information. Why would you do that? How flipping stupid do you have to be to do this? How pathetic of a player do you have to be to spend money, spend real life money to have somebody else play the game for you? Answer that question. Somebody answer that question. Please answer that question. I'm actually curious. I, I'm curious. They won't let me copy that. I'm, I'm dead curious. Um, let's see, I think I've got a video already running. I do. Let, let's check them out. Oh, and they're Russian on top of that. Look at that. They're flipping. It's a Russian company. So that explains why, why Wargaming allows it to happen. What do you want to bet? And I'm just, I'm, I'm putting on the tinfoil hat here. What do you want to bet Wargaming is running this company? Anybody want to anybody want to take me on that bet? Anybody? I would almost be willing to bet that Wargaming is running this company. 
because they're trying to pump as much money into their coffers as possible. Just a thought. <laughs> Think about it. It makes sense. Why wouldn't they? You're not allowed to report them. You can't report the messages. And even if you could, Wargaming War does absolutely nothing about it. They still allow it to happen. They still allow these accounts to run on their platform. It only makes sense that they would, they would be running this company as well. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Something to think about, right? Let's look at services. What do we got here? Um, choose the service you want. So if you want the uh, LBZ 2.0, you can get it. If you want the uh, 1.0, you can get it. Um, if you want, if you want to get get marks on your barrel, <laughs> uh, if you want to get marks of excellence on your barrel, they'll do it for you. <laughs> if you want to, if you want to raise your stats, so it looks like you're a really good player when you're really not, they'll do it for you. If you want to ace your tank, they'll do that for you. <laughs> If you want to, if you want them to, to to grind your credits, they'll do it for you. If you want them to grind experience, they'll do that too. Platoon with pros. This is a service perfect for getting unacquainted, <laughs> for getting acquainted with the service, since there is no need to transfer an account, and you will clearly see the abilities of our drivers. So basically, they're saying, hey, if you want to platoon with us, you can pay us, and you can platoon with us. <laughs> Um, if you want to go down a line, say you want to go down the uh, check line and uh, you're starting from zero, they'll take you from zero to ten. They'll, they'll pay you for that or you'll pay them for that. No problem. Downing of the stars. What the hell is that? Gaining increased experience for the first victory. So if you if you're too lazy to play a game in a tank for the first time, enough times to, to get your first winning battle in the game. They'll they'll do that for you as well. It, wow, you're paying to be lazy. <laughs> you're basically saying I'm too lazy to even play one game in my tank in order to get the experience modifier for the first win. I'm gonna pay you to do it. <laughs> oh crap! Top damage battles. Yeah, okay. They they can't even guarantee that. They can't even guarantee that. Wow. Like, they would have to play your game several times in order to get that. <laughs> minimum cost. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure they're minimum. I'm almost tempted to create a spoof account just to test how much money they're, they would charge. I, I'm 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 curious. I don't want to give them any of my actual money, so I I just I don't want to click anything that would do that. Um. So they've got nine people running this, five hundred comp five hundred plus customers. So <laughs> and, and they've completed seven hundred orders. So these customers are paying them for multiple things. Uh, but they've only got nine people running the company actually playing your stuff and they've got over 500 customers which means it's going to take them probably a year or more before they'll even get to you <laughs> warranties and reviews 100% safe yeah I'm sure it is 24-7 support I'm sure we just saw the little pop-up that says we have nobody online right now sorry leave us a message <laughs> so we already know that's false. <laughs> look, look, hello. Unfortunately, there are no active operators on the site at the moment, but you can still send us a message and we will contact you. But you're supposed to have 24 seven support. There's always supposed to be somebody online. <laughs> so if they lied about this, which they clearly have done, that means they'll lie about any of it. So why this is not safe, guys. Why would you do that? This this screams scam to me. Affordable prices, yeah, I'm sure. 
Without cleans and bugs, high class. Oh, high class. Johnny, I dare say, are they high class? Well, I don't know. How about if we ask them? Hey, Ivan, are you high class? Da, da, we very high class. Let me finish vodka and I will go play tank. Um, yes, it, it certainly does seem like they're high class, Nigel. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Oh my goodness, frequently, let's, what's the frequently asked questions? Of course, uh, let's translate this. What's the principle of AA? Will my account be stolen when ordering pumping? Excluded! Da, you, you are excluded from being stolen. We will not steal account because you are excluded. What? <laughs> Your account must be linked to a mobile number. Uh, no, it doesn't. That is false. Your account does not have to be linked to a mobile number. For example, I play on Steam. And guess what? My account is not linked to a mobile number. Yeah. Now, if I go through the Wargaming site, it does. But your numbers change. You can change your numbers. So, <laughs> um, yeah, they, they, they can totally steal your account. Even if we want to change the password on your account, you'll receive an SMS confirmation on your mobile phone, without which it is impossible to change the password. Yeah, the all it's going to say is that there are changes being made to your account. Do you do you accept the changes or do you approve the changes? It doesn't tell you what the changes are. <laughs> so most people, because they're lazy, which is why they're they're doing this, they'll see that SMS message and they'll go, "Oh yeah, I accept." And boom, your account's stolen just like that. And you paid them to do it. <laughs> you paid them to steal your account. Who will be pumping my account? Pump it real good. Um, yeah, uh, anybody. Uh, one of those nine people. <laughs> How long will it take to upgrade my account? It depends on your order. Comrade, if you ask for impossible, it will take very long time. You will not be able to play game. <laughs> Oh, can I play myself while leveling up my account? Yes, of course, we agree on your window. So basically you say, look, you can play my account during these times. That's what they're trying to say. Uh, but the truth is, is they can play the account anytime they want to and effectively lock you out of your account. Like they can just have the, once you give them access to your account, they can log in and just keep you logged in. And now you're screwed. You you won't be able to log into your account to play. <laughs> oh my goodness. And people do this. People actually flip and do this. Uh, World of Tanks news. Who cares? And here's the information. <laughs> and look, I, if anybody out there is... Um, uh, how do I put this? savvy in the ways of uh, manipulating things over the internet uh, here's the information for you um, please by all means manipulate away if you want <laughs> I'm just saying <laughs> I would not begrudge you if you did uh, but anyways um, yeah uh, how, how, how stupid and pathetic do you have to be I mean it could be legit they could be totally 100% legit, but this screams scam to me. And as somebody who works with classified information and stuff like that, you learn to pick up on certain things like phishing and stuff like that. Um, this screams 100% scam. It, this this just tells. It's not hard to get your money and disappear. All right, guys. I will say that. It's not hard for them to get your money and disappear. So if you're interested in doing something like this, uh, be very, very, very careful. Um, I would urge you not to. Uh, for one, because it makes you a useless, pathetic player. And why are you even playing? If you're going to pay somebody else to play the game for you, just don't install. 
the game's not for you. Why are you, why do you, why, why, why do you even have the game? Why are you, why do you have an account? If you're so lazy that you can't even play the game for yourself, why, why even bother? <laughs> why? I don't understand. You're just throwing money away. I mean, if you're going to throw money away, send it my way. Give me the money. Don't give these guys the money. Give me the money. I could use it. I'll put it to good use. <laughs> I got bills to pay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I will take your money and put it to good use if you just want to throw money away. I'll be more than happy to do that. <laughs> Um, but anyways guys I, th this video is long enough um, if you want more information on game rigging cheaters and stuff like that I urge you to check out Klaus Kellerman on YouTube um, really all you gotta type in is Klaus C-L-A-U-S -C and then space Kellerman with a K K-E-L-L-E-R-M-A-N uh, check him out on YouTube he's got a whole series on game rigging cheaters and he goes in depth he actually proves that these people exist beyond a shadow of a doubt he proves that they exist and as you can see right here they definitely exist so <laughs> with that guys if you like the video hit that like button if I've earned it hit that subscribe button and as always be safe be cool and have fun we'll catch you in the next one